Advertisement British scientists are warning that the new UK variant, B.1.17, of COVID-19 is deadlier than the original strand. According to new studies, experts have determined that the new strand is likely associated with an increased risk of hospitalization and death compared to the first strand of the corona. Get push notifications with news, features and more. Follow following Yelp get the latest updates on this topic in your browser notification. The overall picture is one of something like a 40 to 60 percent increase in hospitalization risk and risk of death. Neil Ferguson, an epidemiologist and scientific advisor with the British government, told the New York Times of their the new variant first appeared in England in September and now makes up over 90% of cases in the around 121,674 have died from COVID-19 in the UK since the onset of the pandemic, half of those since the new variant began to spread, for God. UK. This has been quite catastrophic in terms of mortality, Ferguson added. And that's a result of both the increased transmissibility, and the increased lethality. There are currently no clear reasons for an elevated death rate with however, scientists previously said that there is a realistic possibility that the new variant is more contagious I think these results are possibly genuine, although there are still several limitations and we need to understand what causes it, Muxovic, another scientific advisor and in infectious disease act. There are other explanations of this increased severity, she added, noting that it may transmit disproportionately in settings with fr experts believe that the new variant is at least 30 to 50 percent more infectious. It has since spread to at least 82 other countries, including the United American officials believe that the new strand could become the dominant source of infection here by March. The Times re rapidly changes, is committed to providing the most recent data in our cover. Some of the information in this story may have changed after publication. For the latest on COVID-19, readers are encouraged to use online resources from the has partnered with Go.